we're officially at the point where teams have one of two options, win or go home. Welcome back to the pregame huddle. I'm your host, Donovan Varney, and with me today is reporter Ashley Fry, and these two teams are no stranger to playoff competition. Yeah, absolutely not. Barnesville and Wheelersburg have actually met in the playoffs the past two years in a row, and both times it was Wheelersburg that took that dub, sending Barnesville home and ending their playoff run. But we know it's a new season, and these are new teams. Barnesville is 10-0 and on the season, averaging 52.2 points per game while only allowing 6.5. In addition to that, four of the Shamrocks' 10 games were shutouts this season. For Wheelersburg, we're looking at a 6-4 and four season, averaging 29 points per game and allowing 15.8. Yeah, you can tell by those numbers that Barnesville's been dominant this season. What's gone into such a successful run for the Shamrocks? Well, I got to see Barnesville play week one, and dominant is definitely the best word to describe them. They are insanely physical, one of the most well-conditioned and disciplined teams I have seen all year. The Shamrocks are absolutely a force to be reckoned with. Well, what about Wheelersburg? Their numbers don't jump out as much, but does this mean anything coming into Friday's game? This is by no means the first year that Barnesville has been dominant. They were 12 and 0 when they met an 8 and 3 Wheelersburg team last year, and the Pirates still got it done. Wheelersburg is no stranger to being the underdog to Barnesville and showing exactly what they can do. But last year, Wheelersburg was a pretty balanced team with their run and pass game. While this season they have relied heavily on the ground, and I think this game comes down to who can control the ball. This game will for sure be an interesting one, and lucky for you and I, we'll be there to see it together. That's right, we will. The past two years, this game has not disappointed. For more of the pregame huddle, make sure you catch all of our breakdowns, previews, and more on Facebook, YouTube, and X. And don't forget to catch Ashley and I's breakdown of this game on episode 11 of Gridiron Glory tomorrow night at 11.30 p.m. on WAV in the WAV YouTube channel. Until then, remember, there's nothing better than Friday nights and Gridiron Glory.